and Kim Zimmer. Ladies and gentlemen, your host for the 17th Annual Daytime Emmy Awards, Oprah Winfrey. And welcome to the 1990 Daytime Emmys, the show that's got more tears than a soap, more prizes than a game show, and more thanks than a prayer meeting. And more people with more things to say about more other people than even the Oprah Winfrey Show. We're here today to honor the outstanding creative individuals in daytime television. Not necessarily the favorite, not necessarily the most popular, not necessarily the highest rated, but the ones who, in the opinion of their knowledgeable peers, have done the most outstanding work. To receive an enemy, of course, is a very high honor because it comes from people who start every morning by saying, how do we make this thing work today? <laughs> well, what the Emmy says is that you not only made it work, but that you made it excellent. And we'll be right back with all the folks who made it excellent this year. The 17th Annual Daytime Emmy Awards, brought to you by Johnson's Baby Powder. Smooth it on and feel soft as the day you were born. AT&T, the right choice. Colgate Products, because your smile was meant to last a lifetime. And CoverGirl Cosmetics. is the day you were born. When you have as little as 12 months to grow from a newborn into an adult, every day is crucial. A growing puppy needs about twice the nutrition of an adult dog. That's why we put extra protein and iron in Purina Puppy Chow brand puppy food. Because without extra nutrition now, your puppy could face a tough climb ahead. They say the little people put a spell on it so the scent of it could last a man clean through the day. Ah, uh, capture the lasting scent of Irish spring deodorant soap. The Irish never quit. What's the real story, Dick Tracy? Did Beatty's off-camera romance with co-superstar Madonna leave her breathless? The details in this week's People and all those loving leading ladies in Warren's past. This week, heartthrob or heartbreaker? People, that's what we're all about. Talk about me, talk about you, talk about fun and the sun and the crazy little things they do. Talk about a summertime, talk about a some, some, summertime. With the AT&T Talk About a Summertime promotion, great things are coming your way. Like savings on family entertainment and special calling days with AT&T quality at some of our lowest prices ever. But only if you're talking with AT&T. Talk about a summertime, talk about a summertime. of this year in daytime drama for me was when I found out that Opal was back. She is one of my favorite kind of girls, never afraid to say whatever is on her mind. Here is the actress who plays her, and she also brought along her son, Tad the Cad, with her. From All My Children, Jill Larson and Michael Knight.
You look good. Oh, yeah? This old uh, rag? Yeah. You like it, huh? Nice. Are you kidding? Uh, this is what I always wear to a Times Square in the middle of the afternoon, doesn't everybody? <laughs> Looks that way. Yeah. Our first Emmy today goes to the outstanding supporting actress in a daytime drama. Only in daytime can you find the range of actresses assembled in this category. And only in daytime can you believe the array of emotions and events their characters must endure. And only in daytime can you believe that I play his mother. <laughs> 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 Here are the nominees. <laughs> you keep believing in me and we can make it. Shut up! Don't you understand? It disgusts me to know that I am capable of loving someone like you. You don't have a soul. I clung to that one moment of goodness that you had with Stuart. I lied to myself. It wasn't a lie. No, all right, don't touch me. You, just, you make me feel dirty. Your son was your obsession, and I guess that you were mine, but no more. No more. Brooke. Just get Brooke, out of my room. No. Just get out! No, I'm not... Get out! I mean it! From all my children, Julia Bond. Why did you take Mara? I went to the house. I was knocking. Nobody answered. She was... She... She was running around, she was panicking. What was I supposed to do? You broke the pane on the door, right? The glass? Yes, Josh, I had to. The door was locked. Reva, nobody was home. I, I, I couldn't figure out why you'd left her alone. From Guiding Light, Michelle Forbes. Yeah. Yeah. But of course not least. A lovely little number for those quiet, intimate nights at home with the woman you love, perhaps by um, a hot, roaring fire. From General Hospital, Lynn Herring. <laughs> you stay away from me, Jill, I promise you. You promise you will... me? What, David? What are you going to do? Rough me up, tough guy? You're going to shoot me, huh? You're pushing me, Jill. Yes, I am. Look, Nina loves me. She'd never listen to anything you have to oh, say. Oh, she will this time. Because I am her son's grandmother. You've forgotten that? There's somebody I care about more than myself. And I will stop at nothing to protect him from you. So, you're out of Nina's life. And you're out of the baby's life. You got that? You're gone. You're history. Now, you get on that plane, or by God, I'll make you wish you had. Jess Walton. Give me that was very rude if you're grabbing the phone out of my hands like that. Just shut up! Now give me the bonds. No, no, I won't give them. What would you be doing with Catherine's bonds anyway? And what's in that little bottle you're holding? Give me the damn bonds. What in the world's gotten into you? You... Jimmy, you're not yourself at all. I told you to shut up. My darling, I, I, I was just uh, worried about you. From General Hospital, Mary Jo Catlett. <laughs> and the winner is, from all my children, Julia Bond. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> no, this is, this is really an honor. I can't tell you. Um, but I have to say that a more accurate description of it is that it's the icing on the cake for me because um, for the last 14 years, I have had the privilege and honor of working with a talented, generous, creative group of people, and I could not have asked for more. And, ooh, ooh. <laughs> I just want to thank you, all my children. I really do. And also because life is not a soap opera, thank God. Um, I want to thank my husband, Richie. 
And if my sweet daughter Allison is watching, yes, Mom won the Enemy Award. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, from One Life to Live, welcome Joe Lando and Jessica Tuck. In the category of Outstanding Supporting Actor, we have an embarrassment of riches. There are seven actors nominated. Of course, I'm not one of them. Yes, and that's the embarrassment. But it's the wrong category for you anyway, Joe. Mm. You belong in special visual effects. <laughs> Here are the Magnificent Seven. You sure of all this? You're not going to change your mind again? Look, all I know is it was wasteful and it was stupid to keep alive some rebellion when there was nothing to rebel against. Oh, at least we finally found a way to classify me. That was a stupid waste of your precious time, right? No, no you're right. You're right. I was more than that. At least at the end. Hell, I was uh, valuable insurance. Something you could fall back on in case Cruz wouldn't have you back. From Santa Barbara, Roscoe Bourne. Fuck that, Larry. You talking about you? Are you the family? Why don't you just look around? You're all alone. Nobody's here with you. Brooks gone. Sky's gone. God only knows what you did to poor Dixie. I didn't do anything. I don't see uh, You want to know, you want to know what family is? The little baby you have right now, that's family. But when he grows up and finds out what you really are, you're not going to have him anymore. How is it you succeeded in step by step destroying everybody who ever cared for you? You don't know what you're talking about. I know exactly what I'm talking about. That's why I can't wait to get the hell out of here. Well, then why don't you get the hell out of here? I am going. going. You all alone in that big old comfy bed of yours. Yes, I, I have been sleeping in that big old comfy bed of mine, and I like it that way because because I can I can spread out. You know, I can sleep any way I want to sleep. And if you must pry about my sleeping conditions, I uh, I didn't I didn't sleep so well last night. Really? Well, were you um thinking about me? You wish. This man beside me is my son. He and I are on a quest for a most beautiful lady. I can tell by looking in your eyes that you are a very honest man and that you will let us go and not block our way. Give me the keys. You must think that I am a total idiot. Man, are you full of yourself. But you listen to me, mister. You don't own me. And for that matter, you don't own your wife either. You leave Doreen out of this. Oh, the way you've left her out most of her life, no wonder she can't stand the sight of you. I gave your wife what she never got from you, man. Love and attention. She was starved for it, and she responded in every way. That she may have your name, and you may be able to lock her up with all the rest of your prized possessions. But you don't own her. From Generations Christoph St. John. Yeah. And I with you. Therefore, all the fears in the world. And by the way, I have a few of them myself. All the fears in the world can't keep us apart. From Guiding Light, Jerry Verdorn. It all started this morning. You, woman, you had me so churned up. When I left this morning, I almost turned around and came back. Now, here I am, bringing new meaning to the phrase, champing at the bit. You spend 647 hours in the bathroom. That isn't teasing a man, oh yes it is. Well, I hope it's worth waiting for. 
we're about to find out. And from the young and the restless, Queen Redica. And the winner is... Henry Darrow. Henry's not here tonight, so he'd like me to read this note for him. I'd like to thank the members of the Academy, my fellow actors, and the production team at Santa Barbara for bestowing this honor on me. Thank you. The category is Game Show Hosts, brought to you by handsome Ron Moss and the enticing Susan Marie Snyder right after this. Daily cleanser invites your skin to a 30-second revival. It's a clean new feeling that'll awaken softer, fresher skin. Because only Daily Cleanser has something special inside. Gentle micro bead capsule filled with precious moisturizer to leave your skin radiantly soft. Buff Puff Daily Cleanser. It feels good. The daily revival for your skin. How to make or break a leg. The same old side dish just doesn't make it. Serve Lipton's tasty chicken rice and sauce, and you've got it made. Lipton rice and sauce. It's not the same old stuff. What's great about Reynolds Wrap is it's so strong. After you've cooked with it, it cleans up in a flash. Nothing works like Reynolds Wrap. This way to get rid of corns is dangerous. But Dr. Scholl's corn removers are clinically proven safe and effective. Within five applications, the painful corn will be replaced with new, softer skin. We guarantee it. Dr. Scholl's corn removers. She's very dry. Her clothes stay drier. Perfect for little girls. I really liked it. Brianna liked it, too. Exactly what you want is dryness. Introducing the driest pampers ever. New Ultra Pampers for girls. Dryer. Definitely dryer. No leaking. No leakage. They're made especially for girls. New Ultra Pampers for girls. More absorbent and 50% faster. To help stop leaks in the middle where girls need it most. Her sheets were drier. Her jammies were dry. She's dry in the morning. Yeah, overnight. My little girl stays dry right in here. Around her legs. We think it's wonderful. Are you my dry little girl? New Ultra Pampers for girls and boys for drier, happier babies. She's a happy baby and I'm a happy mother. What happened? I have to know everything. I just can't wait. Who's having an affair with who? I gotta see. You had to be there. Day TV, you got an effect on me. Will she ever find out? I leave the room for a second. Day TV, you got an effect on me. Well, even their secrets have secrets. <laughs> I love this. Day TV, ABC, you got an effect on me. It gets better. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, the tabulators and guardians of the balloting for today's telecast from the firm of Ernst & Young, Nat Adler, Mel Masuda, and Jeff Rosen. He's bold, she's beautiful. Come to think of it, he's kind of beautiful too. From the bold and the beautiful, Ron Moss, and from As the World Turns, Susan Marie Snyder. Susan Marie, yes. pick a category. Outstanding game show host. All right, Susan, you've chosen outstanding game show host. To win, let's determine those nominees now. He's the debonair minder of the memory bank on classic concentration. Who is Alex Trebek? Correct. Yes! Next. He's the erudite authority of answers on Jeopardy. Who is Alex Trebek? Right again. Yes! 
Finally, he's the silver main ringmaster of The Price is Right. Hint, he's not Alex Trebek. Who is Bob Barker? Yes! 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 Now let's see which of these gentlemen gets an Emmy as a lovely parting gift. And uh, the lucky winner is... Oh, there is a tie in this category. <laughs> From Jeopardy, Alex Trebek. Bob Barker. Thank you very, very much. I can't tell you how scared I was today with two out of three nominations. <laughs> if I had not won, I don't think I'm a good enough actor to sit out there and put a smile on my face and say, isn't that special? Bob won it again. Let's all get our dogs and cats spayed and neutered. Uh, but I am, I am honored to uh, have been selected as a winner along with Bob Barker. He's a man whose work I admire a great deal. Although this is for uh, my work on Jeopardy, I want to take a moment to thank the two important MGs in my life, Mark Goodson and Merv Griffin. And I also want to thank all of the production staffs of both shows because they helped make my life so much easier, both on Classic Concentration and on Jeopardy, and they make it so pleasant. I'll tell you how pleasant this year has been. In March, I celebrated my 30th year on television. In April, I married a beautiful young lady named Jean Curvin from the New York area, and she has added a whole new dimension and special meaning to my life. In May, I discovered that Jeopardy was going into prime time this summer. Early this month, Jean informed me that I'm going to become a first-time father. Today, I get this. Three weeks from now, I celebrate my 50th birthday by flying an F-16 fighter plane. And I'm going out after this show, and I'm going to buy a New York State lottery ticket because <laughs> the way I figure, when you're hot, you're hot. Thank you. Bob Barker couldn't be here today, so he'll send a message saying, I should like to thank everyone who's made it possible for me to receive this honor. You've made me very, very happy. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, from Loving, please welcome Robert Tyler and Noel Beck. Outstanding game show. The nominees are so familiar that you know the shows from just a brief description. For example, someone draws funny pictures and you have to guess what they mean. The weather? <laughs> Try another. We know all the answers, but someone has to make up the questions. Well, that's uh, a presidential press conference. <laughs> Excuse me, um, what is a presidential press conference? Oh, okay. <laughs> There's a price tag on everything, and people spend the entire show guessing how much everything costs. Oh, I know, I know that. I know that one. I know it. That's, um, that's 30-something. <laughs> this is a lot tougher than I thought. You're going to get this one. A beautiful woman helps you solve a mystery by selling you one of her vows. Twin Peaks. <laughs> For Outstanding Game Show, here are the nominees. This is Jeopardy! The answer is, when the Star Spangled Banner was written, this man was president of the U.S. And you did the right thing this time because Madison is right. What was your wager? 1300 that'll take you to 8700 and you are now in the lead as we go to Stacy. Did you come up with Madison? You most certainly did. And if you risk more than $300, you will be the new Jeopardy champion. What was the wager? 
Hey, big, big move. A payoff of $14,800 for Stacy Macias. Congratulations. Carpool. That's it! You got it! You got it! Good job, partner. Good for you. The whole Wrench family is here. Oh, man. What a week it has been for one 17-year-old Tyson Wrench. $37,381 is win, lose, or draw. I want to have a little talk with you. Now, have you always been lucky? Never. 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 Say never. And the winner is Jeopardy. Uh, on behalf of uh, Jeopardy's terrific company cast and crew, I'd like to thank Merv Griffin and Bob Murphy for giving us custody of this extraordinary game show. And I'd like to congratulate Alex for all of the things he mentioned earlier, including the Emmy, which he so richly deserved and won a few moments ago. And to the members of the Academy, thank you very much for honoring Jeopardy with this award. you describe the best frozen yogurt? Smooth and creamy. That's three words. Low calorie. Ah. Uh -huh. Fabulous flavor. Getting warmer. All natural. Uh, simply delicious. Mom, Baskin Robbins. It's not just yogurt, it's Baskin Robbins. Kmart gets you organized with Rubbermaid laundry baskets, waste baskets, and totes. The quality you need at the price you want. Your choice, 588. I tried this new restaurant, I had a miniature chicken. Squab. With a magnolia on the side. Gardenia. Tonight it's a sandwich and a smooth, mellow A&W cream soda. <laughs> nice centerpiece. With a salad. A&W cream soda. There's just more to it. La coupe. La sleek. Is la fashion. La bang bang. For la hair. La do. La coupe. annual Daytime Emmy Awards will continue in a moment. Thursday. All this time I pictured Harry in some penthouse office having power lunches. You didn't know. When her husband is murdered, Shirley Jones takes over the family business. Why are they shooting at us? An all-new drama special, Charlie Thursday. Come into Highlands Holiday Event and you can enjoy this holiday weekend Highland style. Catch a wave. Maybe go for a spin. Just chill out. Pick up a portable AM-FM dual cassette with high-speed dubbing for $29. With the money you save celebrating this holiday weekend Highland style, you will have plenty of time to cook. Highland's holiday event going on now. Great expectations start at home. For more information on getting involved in your child's education, Call 449-0400, extension 4411. Now there's an exceptional paper towel. Two layer thick, sparkle.
becomes absorbent and it cleans, leaving virtually no lint on glass, no lint on tile, no lint on windows or mirrors. So with sparkle paper towels, you end up with something remarkable, something clean. Sparkle. All it leaves is clean. Are America's workers stoned? Next to Raldo. Here's an actress who was abducted... Here's an actress who was abducted from her own wedding by a man driving a fire truck. Sounds like something I read about myself in the tabloids last week. Or we'll read about next week now that I mentioned it. Uh, she is here with the man who is pursuing her on foot this time. From Days of Our Lives, Matthew Ashford and Melissa Brennan. This year, the nominees for Outstanding Animated Program feature the cutest, cuddliest, most adorable creatures anyone ever drew. I'm so glad you had that line. <laughs> there are adorable chipmunks. A cute little puppy. <laughs> and a cuddly Pooh Bear. And a cuddly creature from the world of the undead. <laughs> Beetlejuice. <laughs> All right, forget the cuddly part. For Outstanding Animated Program, the entertaining, amusing, and animated nominees are... There's a tie in this category. Beetlejuice and the New Adventures of Winnie the Pooh. How nice. Um, members of the Academy, ladies and gentlemen, mom and dad, uh, I'd, on behalf of myself and all the people who work so hard on the uh, new adventures of Winnie the Pooh, I'd like to thank you for awarding this to us. Uh, this award has significance in a couple of ways for us. First, it, it awards uh, excellence, and there's a lot of excellence on this uh, particular show that deserves to be rewarded. Also, it encourages us because we are very concerned and aware of our traditions with uh, Winnie the Pooh, our traditions with uh, our ties to A.A. A. Milne, and our ties to the previous uh, productions of the past years on Winnie the Pooh, and this tells us that we've been going in the right direction. I'd like to uh, thank personally that uh, man who has made it possible for me to be here this, uh, this day, and that is Carl Gears, the, my predecessor as producer. Thank you all very much.
Well, Beetlejuice is a very special project to work on, and there's so many people that contributed to the success of the series. I would like to thank Tim Burton for keeping things weird. Um, all the good folks at Warner Brothers, uh, Jenny Trias and Amy Simon at ABC, our producers at Nelvana, Patrick LeBaire and Michael Hirsch. Uh, great story work by Patsy Cameron and Ted Nasty, our director Robin Budd. Uh, voice talent of uh, Stephen Wimette and Allison Court. Um, just a lot of really good people that really pulled together and just made this a success. Thanks for everything. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, from General Hospital, Brad Lockerman, Kimberly McCullough, and Fenona Hughes. present the award for the most outstanding children's series. So we brought along our resident expert here. Okay, Bucko, what's your favorite show? Okay, Bubblehead. <laughs> okay, I think it's the one about the spunky teenager whose parents are both spies and who finds a handsome alien living in her garage. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, no, that no. sounds like General Hospital. No. I didn't think that was for children. Did you think that was for children? Oh, it depends no. on which character you follow. Yeah, well, the Emmy will be awarded to a more traditional type of children's program. Not only are these exceptional children's shows, <laughs> they are among the most widely praised programs American television has ever produced. Here are the nominees. Captain Kangaroo. Mr. Rogers' Neighborhood. <laughs> Pee Wee's Playhouse. <laughs> Reading Rainbow. <laughs> Sesame Street. And the winner be... <laughs> Reading Rainbow. Very, very good. We've been doing this show for eight years now, and we truly believe that there is no more important endeavor than to support and nurture the minds and souls and hearts of children. This is really, really gratifying to us. On behalf of all of those in the family of Reading Rainbow, both here on the stage, our producers and executive producers, all of those on the staff, back in the office, those at GPN, and our station in Buffalo, we truly thank you. We are enormously grateful for this. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, from Generations, Christoph St. John and Vivica Fox. has long been noted for its treatment of sensitive issues. The programs nominated in this category all tackle contemporary problems with a candid, forthright approach. They deal with subjects as diverse as consumer awareness, the pesticide controversy, and the discovery of war criminals living in America. So it might not surprise you that they are nominated for Emmys. But it might surprise you that they are nominated for Outstanding Children's Special. The nominees are... A Town's Revenge. Buy Me That, A Kid's Survival Guide to TV Advertising. Flower Babies. A Matter of Conscience. And the winner is A Matter of Conscience.
I'd like to thank Judy Price at CBS for her ardent support of this production. Carolyn Seslick at CBS for her assistance. Our writer, Paul Cooper, for giving us such a compelling story to tell. And our director, John Rubenstein, for so beautifully realizing that story. I'd also like to thank my family and my husband. Thanks. I'd like to thank our wonderful cast and crew. I'd also like to thank our, our great crew and all their support. And thank you very much. Bye. -bye. Maybe the reason more people switched to Glidden than any other paint in the last five years is because we've got the color they're looking for. Glidden, a better way to paint. I stalk the wild gorilla. Careful not to be noticed. He moves in and out of the light. But with 35 millimeter one film from Polaroid, I can capture this majestic creature in low light, bright light, inside or out. With the same roll of one film, I can shoot under almost any conditions. 35 millimeter one film, the simple choice from Polaroid. Ah, the thrill of safari. Next stop is the polar bear. Wait! The smudge stops here. New anti-smudge mascara from CoverGirl. Rich, rich color that's very anti-smudge. Outstanding definition that's very anti-smudge. Long, long wear that's very, very smudge-proof. New anti-smudge mascara. It doesn't mess around. Let's say you win a first-class vacation to sunny Florida. Where do you go? You go to the movies. It's the AT&T Long Distance Talk About a Summertime Sweepstakes. And it's your chance to win a family vacation to the new Universal Studios Florida. It's easy to enter. Just stop by any AT&T phone center or check the June 30th TV guide. The Talk About a Summertime Sweepstakes. It's one of the great things coming to AT&T customers this summer. Talk about a summertime. Ladies and gentlemen, from all my children, Kate Collins and James Kybird, and from loving Susan Keith. I'm delighted to be here today with two of my favorite women. <laughs> he's married to me. But he'd like to be married to me. But he's really married to me. Wait until the next ratings period. Daytime actors lose touch with reality on the next Geraldo. <laughs> Kate is the woman I would like to make my wife. What? On all my children. Susan is my wife in real life. Well, I'm glad we cleared that up. <laughs> we did clear that up, we didn't did. we? We did. All right. Real life is what the performer we're about to honor does very well. The award is for outstanding talk or service host, a person who must be equally at home interviewing housewives or heads of states, guiding discussions of vital issues of the day and handling guests of every political and social stripe, and in one case, dealing with a souffle that just wouldn't rise. <laughs> <laughs> and the worthy nominees are Phil Donahue. Oprah Winfrey. <laughs> Sally Jesse Raphael. <laughs> Jeff Smith. <laughs> and Joan Rivers. And 
and the winner is, I'm shaking, Joan Rivers. <laughs> had a fantasy, you know, as a child that I'd win one of these, and uh, I never thought I'd be the soul when the fantasy came true, but here it is. And uh, <laughs> I didn't think I was going to win. I'm not being cute. Um, so I have no speech prepared. I have to thank, um, uh, uh, I have to thank everyone at Tribune. They taught me what it's like to work with honorable, decent people, and pe no, you don't know. <laughs> you know, I don't mean it that way. Thank you to Shelly and to Peter Marino and, and to Don Hacker, to my staff who was incredible, and I don't mean this cute, 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 I mean working at five in the morning happily, to our crew that's wonderful, to Dorothy Melvin, my manager, to Steve Ober who started the show, to Larry who has just brought us to what it is today, Larry Ferber, and especially, I know the red light's on, so I have to hurry, to my daughter Melissa because uh, the last two years have been very difficult. Two years ago, I couldn't get a job in this business. I could not get a job. My income dropped to one sixteenth of what it was before I was fired. And people said I wouldn't work again. And my husband, as you know, had a breakdown. It's, it's so sad that he's not here because it was my husband, Edgar Rosenberg, who always said, you can turn things around. And except for one terrible moment in a hotel in Philadelphia when he forgot that, this is really for him because he was with me from the beginning, and I'm so sorry. He's not here. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, from Guiding Light, Morgan England and Susie Cote. This year's nominees for Outstanding Talk Service Show are a rich, diversified group that have shown us how to fix up a house, how to save money in the kitchen, as well as what's going on in the bedroom, who's coming out of the closet, and what's being swept under the rug. They're informative, influential, and entertaining, and they are. Ebersol, the president of, or the vice president for the Today Show. I'm not sure what his title is. President of NBC Sports and the vice. Said you were apprised of everything. You were told everything that was going to happen. You stepped forward to tell us you did not know that you'd find, suddenly find yourself sitting next to another woman on the couch if, at the top of the hour, which John Palmer designed, never did, we should say. No, if an architect designs a house for you, he doesn't say, and the drapes will look just like this. He does if I've been and living in it for 13 years. <laughs> Hang on to your chairs, we're going to Hong Kong right now. I think it's time to eat. This is a meal offered us by Maxim's. Maxim's has a whole chain of restaurants in Hong Kong and they are superb. You're witnessing the dragon and the phoenix. The phoenix, of course, uh, is, uh, is a uh, uh, lobster. Excuse me, that's the dragon. The phoenix is a chicken, and we're eating part of the chicken tail right now, and the dragon uh, is a big lobster from the sea. This man has had a baby for two years. You're telling me that that baby should be ripped from that... No, that I didn't say that. I did not say that. Did I say that? I did not say that. I did not say that. I did not say that. I am concerned about that child's future. Right. That's what right I said. Right now, it's a novelty I am idea. not concerned about the future of any child whose father is close to tears and loves that child enough to put everything he's got on the line for that child. I'm not worried about that. I am. Not at all. Hi, I'm Steve Thomas. Welcome to this old house. 
Well, today we celebrate the arrival of our beautiful oaken staircase, which was made for us in Nina, Wisconsin. at a man a little bit longer than she should, he'll get the message. Men sometimes can be a little unconscious because they don't pick up flirting as easily as women do. They don't Ain't pick up the on truth. the body language. <laughs> so you have to really look a, a full 15 seconds right in their eyes until they feel uncomfortable and look away. 15. And then they know, that's a long time. <laughs> <laughs> a little thick. <laughs> is Sally Jesse, Jesse Raphael. <laughs> Thanks to the Academy, uh, to Multimedia, to uh, Walter Bartlett, uh, Jim Lina, and Peter Lund, who uh, is our president, and really, I must say, has given us uh, a sense of importance. He's made us feel very important. He's one of the few executives that uh, I've ever worked with, we've ever worked with, that understands the producer. That's either going to be uh, good for him or bad for him in the home office, I'm not sure. To uh, those people back there who uh, are really the uh, backbone of what the Sally Jesse Raphael show is all about. To the people in the office who are there watching and uh, they're very, very important to us. To that lady down there with uh, blonde hair and red glasses. Everybody used to say she's the lady with blonde hair and red glasses. And now everybody knows her name. It's Sally Jesse Raphael. We love you. You are the best. And to your husband, Carl, we love him too. To all of our families, to mine, to Lynn, Allison, and Liza. Yep. We did it! A lot more of your favorite daytime stars, plus a very special award after this. We've tried them all. The grapefruit diet. The Malibu diet. The creative visualization diet. You were supposed to imagine that this was mm -hmm. a fat, juicy cheeseburger. One thing worked. Sure, she tried a one-calorie diet A&W root beer. And she tried an A&W diet cream soda. And we had no problem at all imagining we were drinking something fabulously rich and delicious. <gasps> Look what I've got. My favorite, lemon meringue pie. Diet A&W root beer and cream soda with 100% NutraSweet. There's just more to it. The best undressed bodies of 1990. What are they wearing? The barest essentials. What else are they wearing? Designer Imposters body sprays. They're designer quality fragrances, but not designer prices. They're only around $3 each. So let them fragrance you, refresh you, keep you cool and inviting all over. Designer Imposters body sprays. Only from Parfums de Coeur. The best undressed bodies in the world wear them.
That's me, Cristino Ferrari, after I had my baby. Since then, I lost 25 pounds in three months with the Ultra Slim Fast plan. It was easy. Ultra Slim Fast is really delicious and satisfying. I'd have a thick chocolate shake for breakfast, another for lunch, then a great dinner. I love Ultra Slim Fast. It gave me back my figure, and I feel great. Now the only baby fat in this family is on the baby. Ultra Slim Fast. Give us a week. We'll take off the weight. Believe it or not, I'll be the first to admit it. Palm olive isn't the only dishwashing liquid that softens hands while you do the dishes. I can think of at least one more. Palm olive, lemon, lime. If you're looking for a way to get your dishes clean without ruining your hands, you can dine out, take out, toss out, or pour out. Palm olive dishwashing liquid. Ladies and gentlemen, from the Academy of Television Arts and Sciences, Mr. Leo Chalukian. And from the National Academy of Television Arts and Sciences, Mr. Michael Collier. This year, as television enters the second half of its first century, life, the Lifetime Achievement Award for, for the daytime goes to an individual whose cumulative accomplishments are beyond the scope of our standard categories. He is a man who has helped create, nurture, and sustain one of the most endearing and entertaining program formats of them all. Michael? And to present this most prestigious award, we are delighted to have with us one of America's favorite comedians, an Emmy-winning actress who has the distinction of having appeared successfully in almost every kind of television program. There aren't many ladies who fit that description, and only one who is as golden a girl as Emmy herself, the wonderful Miss Betty White. <laughs> Thank you, it is so exciting to be here, to, and you might you might wonder, what could get me to come all this way in from California, especially in this dress? But... <laughs> well, it's my good friend, Mark Goodson. Now, some of you listening might not know about Mark, but I've been familiar with him for years. And, well, he's been a very big part of my life for a long, long time, and of yours, because it was Mark Goodson who introduced into the American vocabulary such phrases as, will the mystery guest sign in, please? And will the real Elvis Presley please stand up? And let's see what our survey found. And my personal favorite, the classic, let's go to the lightning round. <laughs> Mark Goodson has given us over 100,000 half hours of sheer enjoyment. Even Marla Maples can't say that. <laughs> but on a personal level, it was Mark Goodson. <laughs> what do I know, I'm a kid. <laughs> But on a personal level, it was, it was Mark Goodson who was responsible for introducing me to my husband. We were playing one of Mark's games. Not that one, it was Password. <laughs> and it was the third week of the show, and Alan, of course, was the host, and I was one of the players that he took home. <laughs> <laughs> a Lifetime Achievement Award is something very special. And it can be a little scary, too, because it, it almost implies, well, you can stop now. <laughs> well, the fun will never set on the Mark Goodson empire. And it wasn't Julius Caesar who said it. It was Mark who said, let the games begin. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Mark Goodson. <laughs> It is 
true, by the way, that I did introduce Alan to Betty, and when he first uh, said to me that he was in love with uh, Betty, and Betty did not want to get married, he said, I'm going to wear a diamond ring on a chain around my neck until she agrees. And he did for over a year under his shirt, and she agreed. So it's a very romantic story. <laughs> you know what happens to a person when he finds out he's going to receive a Lifetime Achievement Award? He begins to go back over that lifetime. It's a big word. He starts to rewind the tape. And that's exactly what I did. I, I went back to early beginnings when I was young, and so was television. My first venture was in 1949. It's a wild and crazy stunt show called Beat the Clock, which starred my old radio buddy, Bud Collier, who was the father of Michael Collier, who was out here a second ago. And that was followed by the very elegant What's My Line, which we did in black tie, live, every Sunday night with John Daly and Arlene Francis, and Dorothy Kilgallen, Bennett Cerf and Steve Allen, plus an array of incredible mystery guests from Lucille Ball to Eleanor Roosevelt. The biggest prize was $50, and nobody jumped up and down like he did in the shows you just saw a while ago. But even back then, I found something fascinating in the challenge of new forms which developed comedy intentions not from fiction, but from real life. And I enlisted other young and hungry associates who shared my enthusiasm for reality program, and together we came up with shows like I've Got a Secret and To Tell the Truth and Password and Family Feud and The Price is Right, and the rest. And so it turned out I've dedicated virtually a lifetime to a genre of television which has often been underestimated and misunderstood, the game show. I have often I felt from the beginning that a well-crafted game was one of the most creative forms of television. These have been exciting years and challenging years, and I hope they've been fruitful years. I'm deeply grateful to the Television Academy for this recognition, and I trust this is a comma and not a period in my lifetime achievement. And I can't end without saluting my good friends and associates who have been at my side for so many wonderful years. Thank you for sharing my work, for sharing my dreams, and for sharing my history. Thank you. When you have as little as 12 months to grow from a newborn into an adult, every day is crucial. A growing puppy needs about twice the nutrition of an adult dog. That's why we put extra protein and iron in Purina Puppy Chow brand puppy food. Because without extra nutrition now, your puppy could face a tough climb ahead. This new toothpaste will blow you away. <sighs> With a breath freshener that's a brush of fresh air. It's new Aquafresh Extra Fresh. With an extra minty, extra fresh breath freshener that wow. beats the leading brand. So next time you brush, get cavity-fighting fluoride and plaque-removing power plus an extra fresh breath freshener all in one. New Aquafresh Extra Fresh. It's a brush of fresh air. Buff Puff Daily Cleanser invites your skin to a 30-second revival. It's a clean new feeling that'll awaken softer, fresher skin. Because only Daily Cleanser has something special inside. Gentle micro bead capsules filled with precious moisturizer to leave your skin radiantly soft. Buff Puff Daily Cleanser. It feels good. The daily revival for your skin. Hi. Some of you have written to ask, does it matter which plastic bag you use? A question not to be taken lightly. So we placed a brick in a Ziploc storage bag. And then one in a Sure Seal storage bag from Reynolds. Proving once again, it's Sure Seal or bust. They're the toughest plastic bags ever built. Sure Seal bags from Reynolds. It's Reynolds Sure Seal or bust. Da da da. Dee dee. Da 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 da. 25 years ago, they brought us a startling vision of the future. And now... Help! Jane, stop this crazy thing! Get set! They're back. All right! 
in their first feature-length motion picture. Congratulations! Universal Pictures presents Jetson, the movie. Right! Rated G. Starts Friday, July 6th at theaters everywhere. The 17th Annual Daytime Emmy Awards will continue in a moment. Sunday. You know what the Surgeon General says about smoking dynamite. One of television's favorite funny men is back. Oh, Minnie, I want a disco. <laughs> it's the last flick for Mr. Belvedere, right after America's Funniest Home Videos, Sunday. Days of Thunder is taking the critics by storm. Absolutely. It's a winner, raves Joel Siegel. Yes! I loved it. Finally, a movie to see cheers Marilyn Beck. <laughs> And Steve Kometko calls it the best movie of the summer. Four stars. This is what it's all about. Tom Cruise. You're very quick. You gotta see me drive. Games of Thunder, rated PG-13. Now playing at theaters everywhere. Pop popcorn cakes from Chico-san. The only national brand made from real popcorn. All the fun and flavor comes through in the crunch. From Chico-san. You know it makes me wanna... Shop Power Stick keeps stains from setting till wash day. In test with spray and wash for overall preference, shout one, two to one. One tough stains out, choose new Power Stick Shout. If you're not recycling, you're throwing it all away. <laughs> Romania's Ugliest Secret, tonight at 6. The 17th Annual Daytime Emmy Awards, brought to you by Tampax. For the freedom, for the confidence, more women trust their bodies to Tampax. The makers of A&W, A&W Root Beer and Cream Soda, there's just more to it. Buff Puff. Makers of Buff Puff Daily Cleanser Lotion and Scope, the best thing first thing in the morning. Now I am delighted to bring to the stage the baddest of the bad girls of Port Charles. When we met her, she had everyone convinced that she was a librarian, but then they found her collection of disposable lingerie with her and with her today is the one man who was never fooled her one true love who can say from general hospital the fun couple ken Schreiner and lynn herring you look nice thank you so do you thank you it's said that youth is the carefree time of your life but the four young actresses who are this year's nominees for Outstanding Juvenile Female, well, they can dispute that. Yeah, among them, they've been uh, kidnapped, lost parents and step-parents, uh, befriended aliens, been raised by spies, been in and out of one or more comas. <laughs> you know, that is hardly what I remember when I was growing up. Well, don't ask me. I grew up in show business. Sounds perfectly normal. <laughs> yeah. Um, it takes an exceptional young actress to keep an audience glued through all these mishaps. And these nominees, well, they are spellbinders. I don't want to be a kid anymore. Well, I guess some of us get upset with the way we are sometimes. But you ain't never upset about being an adult. We, yes, actually, sometimes I am. I'd rather be a little girl, you know, without a care in the world and never having to have any responsibilities. You know what I mean? I think so. Isn't that what Dad meant when he used to say, I envy you, love. These are the most important years of your life. Too bad you won't know until they're over. From General Hospital, Kimberly McCullough. Talk about what? Kim, I already know the facts of life. Tell you what, why don't we all go downstairs and have some dinner? Or better yet, oh, why don't you go back into my father's bed and I'll bring it up to you on a tray. Please stop it. Don't tell me what to do, Kimberly. Please, you have no right to tell anybody please, anything. Please listen to me, Eve. You lied listen to, to me. us. You lied to all of us. He's only been gone for like... It's months. He's been dead for months, sweetheart. I don't care. I don't care if you loved him. You wouldn't forget him, Kimberly, if you really loved him. You wouldn't forget him. From Days of Our Lives, Charlotte. You want 
her. If you choose her, then I will go away. I will leave you alone. No, I will no, get no, out of no. your life, but no. you have to choose. You have to want me, not just the baby, me. Please say something. From all my children, Katie McLean. It's not fair. I don't get it. You know, people get married, and they promise they're going to love each other forever. And then out of that love, they have kids. And then you know what? The first time that something goes wrong, bang, they quit. But you know what? It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter because you could just go on. Well, it does matter. What about the kids? What about me? From all my children, Liz Bassey. And the winner is, from all my children, Katie McLean. like to thank my family and all my children. They are the most generous, loving, giving, creative, inspiring people that I've ever worked with. Michael Knight, I love you. I adore you. You make my day shine with happiness. Julia Barr, you are an inspiration to me in your acting and your creativity. David Canary, working with you has been a joy, a thrill. It's been incredible. <laughs> I'd like to thank my two best friends, Dana Roth and Molly McLean. They've supported me and loved me through so many years, and I'm just so grateful to them. And to my dad for sending me two dozen roses after eight years. <laughs> Thanks. I really appreciate it. <laughs> Thank you all. ABC, Agnes Nixon, Felicia Bear, Henry Kaplan for supporting me and for teaching me to grow and giving me a great storyline to fight with and grow with. I love you all. Thank you very much. Ladies and gentlemen, from all my children, Larkin Malloy and Walt Willie. Well, good afternoon, Brother Jackson. Good afternoon, Brother Travis. Before, <laughs> before we do what we uh, came up here to do, there's one thing we want to do first. He like wrote that. Yeah, I did not. Did. Yeah, I did not. <laughs> we would like to welcome back to daytime and specifically welcome into the family of all my children, Miss Jeannie Francis. We're delighted to have her. Thank you, Jeannie. And now, we are here to present the award for Outstanding Juvenile Male. There are only two nominees in this category, both wonderful young actors. You know, Larkin, maybe there's an opening for us here. Uh, no, Walter, uh, you gotta forget it. We're not eligible. My, what's the, what's the cutoff? If you've had an affair with Erica Kane. Well, that takes care of both of us and at the same time. Uh, well, however, there are two young actors who do fit this category very well, very well indeed. From As the World Turns, Andrew Kavovitz. And from Guiding Light, Brian Buffington. And uh, the winner is Andrew Kavovitz.
don't really know what to say. I'd like to start off by dedicating this to my cousin, uh, Mark Brandon, who passed away about a year ago, and to his family, who I love very much. And I'd like to thank my family, starting with my mom and dad, Jeff, Greg, Steve, Rob, and Kim. I love you guys. Troop K, the best. The cast, crew, and staff at As World Turns, Lori Queso, Doug Marland, Robert Calhoun for giving me my start. All my friends, family, and loved ones, I love you guys. Thank you. Come, see the light of a new CoverGirl makeup with a look so light, so faultless. It's called Perfecting Makeup. Now feel the light of color so weightless, it feels beautifully bare. New perfecting makeup in a pump. The light makeup from CoverGirl. As close to perfect as you can get. I stalk the wild gorilla. Careful not to be noticed. He moves in and out of the light. But with 35 millimeter one film from Polaroid, I can capture this majestic creature in low light, bright light, inside or out. With the same roll of one film, I can shoot under almost any conditions. 35 millimeter one film, the simple choice from Polaroid. Ah, the thrill of safari. Next stop is the polar bear. Wait! Talk about me. Talk about you. Talk about fun and the sun and the crazy little things they do. Talk about a summertime. Talk about a summertime. Summer With the AT&T Talk About a Summertime promotion, great things are coming your way. Like savings on family entertainment and special calling days with AT&T quality at some of our lowest prices ever. But only if you're talking with AT&T. Talk about a summertime. Talk about a summertime. If you can't get enough of your favorite toppings, Pizza Hut has the pizzas you'll love. Do you love? The Meat Lover's Pizza. Six mouth-watering meat toppings smothered between two luscious layers of cheese. And now the new Veggie Lover's Pizza with peppers, mushrooms, and tons of other great veggies. Now get a Meat Lover's or new Veggie Lover's for $9.99. Any two for just $4 more. Meat Lover's, Veggie Lover's. Now who do you love? Pizza Hut. Make it great. It's easy to clean your front teeth. But to really clean those hard-to-reach back teeth, you can either get a flip-top head or get a reach toothbrush. It's called reach because, surprise, surprise, it has an angled neck designed to reach right into the back teeth and unique longer, softer outer bristles to massage and clean along gums. So to really clean those hard-to-reach back teeth, either get a flip-top head or get reach from Johnson & Johnson. Our next two presenters are two of the busiest people in television. She is a leading actress on Another World and the co-host of Attitudes, and he is the Emmy-winning host of Jeopardy, Super Jeopardy, and Classic Concentration. Please welcome again Alex Trebek and welcome Linda Dano. <laughs> take the time to say congratulations on everything. Oh, thank you. Oh, the child and the whole thing? The child, the whole thing. Thank you. I'm just delighted to be up here twice today. I, I can't tell you how scared I was. Winning is just so wonderful. And okay. I want to welcome you on behalf of all of the hosts right. to our fraternity oh. of hosts in America. We get together once a year and worship Burke Parks. Uh, <laughs> Merv forces me to do that to do kind that. of thing. Yeah, but I like know you're Merv. here to present the award for outstanding direction of a daytime drama. And okay. since you're the talented actor, actress in this twosome here, why don't you tell the folks what a director does? Oh, okay. Uh, I'll try. Uh, a director is really a person who, well, when an actress comes up with a, a priceless, funny bit of, of business or some, some brilliant expression of emotion, it's the director who comes up to her and he very thoughtfully says, keep that. 
You understand? Good attitude. Yeah, yeah. Well, in that case, as an impartial host, perhaps I should add that the director is really the person who translates the writer's vision from the page to the stage. That and the helps. Academy is delighted to honor these talented nominees. The directing team of All My Children. The directing team of As the World Turns. The directing team of Guiding Light. The directing team of Y&R, Young and Rubicam, The Young and the Restless. And the directing team of Santa Barbara. And the winner is the directing team of Santa Barbara. Santa Barbara. Just great. I'm not sure I can keep this to a minute, but what the heck, I'll try. I'd like to acknowledge this fine directing team that I work with, uh, Rob Schiller, Michael Gleona, Pam Fryman, yeah. Janine France. <laughs> Got through that. Thanks to the Academy. Uh, thanks to everybody that voted for us. It's great. We love it. Thank you to our producers, John Conboy, uh, Jill Phelps, uh, Charlotte Savage, Julie Hannah. Thank you all. You're so supportive. They give us the string that sort of ties our episodes together. We would love it. Thanks to uh, the crew who make these impossible days possible. For sure. They're giving me the rap song. Thank Thanks to everybody. Verasco, the cast, the cast. I cannot leave the cast out. The cast is marvelous. Thanks to Jerry Amott from New World Productions, who with their great salesmanship overseas, make it a really happy trip to go to the mailbox. <laughs> Thank you, one and all. Ladies and gentlemen, from the young and the restless, please welcome Quinn Redeker and Gene Cooper. That you were a loser. I said you simply didn't win this time. Right. The big difference. I heard you. Five, four, three, two, one. We're on. Go. Ah, we're here to honor the group of artists with uh, whom no actor would be able to face the cameras. No, no, no. I, you want to cut that, uh, honey? Pay attention. We're not doing makeup. We're doing the writers. I know that. You did. Know I that. do. Step on. And no, another no, thing. When Corbin up. calls, I'm not going to lie for I you anymore. I'm sick of that name. I can scream. Shut up, Quinn. Just shut up. Nothing in the world in daytime drama is more exciting or more exasperating than writing. You could have, you know, hired professional actors to do this. They hired one. <laughs> Nothing is more brutal than writing and rewriting and finally getting it to where it needs to be. The writing on the shows nominated this year is exactly where it needs to be. For outstanding writing in a daytime drama, here are the nominees. <laughs> What bad news? Well, that Ted is getting married, that he's out of circulation. I believe you, me, the unattached women in this town are not going to take that sitting down. The local Lothario bites the dust. Half of them will go into mourning, but the other half will. They will consider it a, a challenge, the battle call. Boy, they will give Dixie a run for her money. I can assure you it'll be just like what they did to Roxanne last week on Fraternity Row. You got this idea from a soap opera? Well, what's wrong with that? My life is one in yours. You wanted our baby, I was say. Ooh. You wanted our baby. No, I want you gone. I want you out of here today. You could have sent me to Timbuktu. That's not going to change anything. You wanted our baby. Okay. Okay, I wanted her. You want to hear me say it? I wanted her. But not because she was 
yours because she was beautiful. Giving her up was the hardest thing I ever had to do in my life. But I did it for her so she could have something decent. There were things I couldn't give her. I did it because I was alone. Cause we only have one. I want to wake up every morning with my wife. Not, not, with, not with, with my roommate, with my lover, with my girlfriend, with my wife. I want to sit at breakfast. I want to argue over which section of the paper that, that we're going to have with my wife. I want to call her office from my office and I want to make a lunch date. Maybe, maybe I have even a little love in the afternoon with my wife. See, I want to come back here every night. I want to chop up a salad while she's grilling swordfish and I want to share a little glass of white wine with my wife. I, I want to, after we watch Ted Koppel, we've read the best sellers and everything else. I just want to turn off the lights. I want to slip in between the sheets and I just want to know just by touching her, not even having looked at her beautiful little face, that this is my life! life. <laughs> oh. Stop coming! You hear me knocking and calling you? I heard a scream! I heard somebody scream! Oh, everything's fine. Everything's under control. Well, now, what does that mean? It means everything's under control. Good morning, Augusta. Oh, I am so sorry. I had no idea. You're forgiven. I'll be back real soon. I'll come out there and say hello. Okay. Okay. See you later. Okay. Much, much later. Oh. Huh? Start explaining. Well, give me a few seconds to recover. Lying next to the corpse, someone you once... Don't! Derek Stewart was charged with date raping Scott's sister, and the case is already gone to trial. The jury's out right now. And you think he's going to be found not guilty? It looks that way. Unless we can find a woman willing to testify that Derek did the same thing to her. Otherwise, his record's clean. And if you know Derek, you know what a smooth and convincing liar he can be. Oh, I know I'm all right. That's a name I didn't think I'd ever have to hear again. It did happen to you, didn't it? A long time ago. Carla, why didn't you press charges? Let's just say I was strongly encouraged not to. The school administration was worried about their image. They convinced you to go along with that? I was young and naive. I'd just been through the trauma of my life. I thought that they were acting in my best interests. And now? If I had to do it over again, I'd prosecute him for what he did to me. And, and the winner is... The writing team from Guiding Light. <laughs> This year, it's on camera. <laughs> um, you have honored us um, several times with nominations, and thank you so much. Um, thank you, Bob Whalen and Ed Trock and Barbara Garshman from Procter and Gamble, and Lucy Johnson and our very, very, very good friend Judy Jenkins from CBS, uh, Robert Calhoun and the whole production staff. Thank you for. Um, producing those words for us and and we have a wonderful cast that inspires us every day and uh, most of all um, thank you the Bowers and the Spaldings and uh, the uh, Lewis's and the, and the and the Coopers and the Shanes, Reva Shane. 
We write the guide, but you guys guide the light. Thank you. detergent? Well, I don't. And this little guy sure doesn't. And his daddy doesn't look like the perfume type. So we use Unscented Tide. Unscented Tide. Also available in liquid. Do you want that burger to stay or to go? Serve a boring side dish and it's not going anywhere. Serve Lipton's creamy Parmesan noodles and sauce and it's gone. Lipton noodles and sauce. It's not the same old stuff. Imagine if you could look inside your batteries, if you could see how much power they have left, if you could tell how many more pictures you could take or how much longer your flashlight would shine. Well, Duracell has made it possible. Introducing the Copper Top Tester, a gauge which tells you if a battery is good or needs to be replaced. It's like being able to see right inside. The new Copper Top Tester, absolutely free, only from Duracell. How do women feel about New Freedom, the only maxi with the peach protection strip? A lot more secure. Freer. More in control. Here's why. An ordinary maxi lets moisture go all the way to the sides, which can cause accidents. But New Freedom's peach protection strip helps keep moisture in the center of the pad. How will you feel about New Freedom? See for yourself. New Freedom. Protection like this is no accident. The 17th Annual Daytime Emmy Awards will continue in a moment. Tonight, Susan Lucci. Soap opera siren. Will Emmy crown her or snub her for the 11th straight year? It's all right. The only place you'll see her reaction is on Primetime Live tonight. Critics love Betsy's Wedding. ABC TV calls it sensational. The funniest movie in a long time. Gene Shalek says it's got lots of good-natured laughter. And Joel Siegel calls the cast great. Betsy's Wedding, rated R, now playing. And critics and audiences agree Dick Tracy's the family event of the summer. Time Magazine calls it the best comic strip movie yet. Dick Tracy was the best. And Fox TV says take all the little crime fighters and enjoy. It's so cool. Dick Tracy rated PG and Betsy's Wedding, now playing separately at theaters. Great expectations start at home. After all, parents are teachers, too. Come into Highlands Holiday Event and you can enjoy this holiday weekend Highland style. Catch a wave. Maybe go for a spin. Just chill out. Pick up a Hotpoint Fortacool Window Mount Air Conditioner for $186. With the money you save celebrating this holiday weekend Highland style, you will have plenty of time to cook. Highlands Holiday Event, going on now. A future of war on Star Trek, the next generation. Ladies and gentlemen, three-time Emmy winner, David Canary. I don't intend to prolong the agony, except to say that to be chosen among the top five of these ladies is a great honor. Each of these talented women is a worthy competitor. The nominees are... You stole my first dance. You punched up 
B12 on the jukebox. And while Paper Doll played, you danced with me. I was crushed up against you and, and you held me up so that my feet didn't even touch the floor. Twelve. Twelve years old. B-12 on the jukebox. Do you know that I still can't listen to Paper Dow? From Guiding Light, Kim Zimmer. <clears throat> Sit down, Mrs. Turling. You and I are going to have a nice little chat. <laughs> My God, you are despicable. You've robbed me of my family. You've robbed me of my home. And as though that is not enough, you've come here to flaunt all the anguish that you caused me. Hon, now I thought you was going to be just as curious to see me as I was to see you. Well, do you know what I would like to see? because she is considering going back. Wait for it, going back to Montego. Wait for it to give Craig space, space, so he can make a decision about that. I will not allow it. I will not allow Craig to drive my daughter out of my life again. I will not allow it. I will tell him what I think, and I will tell him he's if somebody who's on the phone will get off the damn phone. And as the world turns, Elizabeth Hubbard. The point is that I think that you escaped from my circle. You broke into Scott's apartment. You took his gun to hold against Colton Shaw. You were looking for the diamonds. I don't know anything. And what about a man that. called Daniel London? I don't that want mean to anything answer to any you? more of Why? your questions. Why? He's lying because he's too much of a you leave me alone. I will never leave you alone until you're put in prison because you went too far this time. <laughs> you, you kidnapped Colton Shaw. And this time you will put you away for the rest of the time. What are you trying to do? Get out of here. This has nothing to do with you. The hell it doesn't. I wouldn't even be here if it weren't for her. You want me to feel sympathy for this woman? I'm just asking you to be fair, Anna, okay? Fair? Yes. Don't you see what she's doing? She will do everything she can to make you feel that she's a poor, helpless victim. Look, Anna, we have friends, and I don't want to cross you. Well, don't okay? ever cross me. From General Hospital, from Nola Hughes. Please, I'm not asking for my sake. Please, God, I'm asking for her sake. She's, she's just too young to die. She's just a baby. And she deserves to have her life. She deserves to grow up and be a wonderful woman. She's just a baby. You cannot take a baby. Don't you see that? And from all my children, she's in Lucy. And the winner is... From Guiding Light, Tim Zimmer. years of what to say. <laughs> um, I, there's too many people to thank personally. I have to thank all the men in Reva Shane's life because they've helped me win these things. Larkin Malloy, Larry Gates, Jordan Clark, Robert Newman, who plays the love of my life on Cutting Light. I love you, Robert, wherever you are. <laughs> Most of all, my husband, A.C. Weary, who plays my husband in real life. Pam Long, the writers, I have to thank you for putting the words into Reva's mouth and for the directors for letting me do the things that I do. They have to control me every so often, but I like to chew the scenery. What can I say? For the set designers for letting me do 
do it. <laughs> but most of all, I just have to thank everyone that's involved with Guiding Light, the office staff who, who made up my, <laughs> my goodbye party announcements yesterday. I'm leaving the Guiding Light, but I've always said never say never again, and I will be back someday. <laughs> thank you all very much. Let's say you went a first-class vacation to sunny Florida. Where do you go? You go to the movies. It's the AT&T Long Distance Talk About a Summertime Sweepstakes. And it's your chance to win a family vacation to the new Universal Studios Florida. It's easy to enter. Just stop by any AT&T phone center or check the June 30th TV Guide. The Talk About a Summertime Sweepstakes. It's one of the great things coming to AT&T customers this summer. Talk about a summertime. The great thing about Reynolds Ramp is, it's the one ramp you can depend on to protect your food in the freezer. Nothing works like Reynolds Ramp. What's the real story, Dick Tracy? Did Beatty's off-camera romance with co-superstar Madonna leave her breathless? The details in this week's People and all those loving leading ladies in Warren's past. This week, heartthrob or heartbreaker? People, that's what we're all about. Attention, black fighters. Axeman is here to protect your teeth from the evil effects of black cavities. With fluoride, his secret weapon, Axeman penetrates black, strengthens teeth against cavities like no ordinary mouthwash. Protect your teeth with Axe fluoride rinse, black cavities. Game over. I am woman. In numbers too big to ignore And I know too much to go back and pretend Oh yes, I'm wise And it's wisdom I can claim Oh yes, I've paid the price But look how much I've gained I am woman getting stronger Not a novice any longer As I spread my love and arms across earth message to women we thought you'd feel good knowing that more women trust their bodies to the tampon that's very very kind to the earth tampax tampons biodegradable since 1936 it is my privilege to welcome to the stage a woman who won the very first daytime Emmy ever awarded to a performer ladies and gentlemen Mary Fickett The actors nominated in this category are the best of an extraordinary, strong, and talented breed. Let's take a look at their performances. I just want you to know that there was never a time I did not love and respect you. There was never a time I didn't want your love. I spent my whole life looking up to you. You better than anybody know, I don't look up to much of anybody. But God, how I respect you. You're my best friend, Dad. From the young and restless, Peter Bergman. You know how he feels waiting for me to make my first move? Well, let him wait. Let him squirm. I'm gonna let him dangle over the fire, and then I cut the thread. I'm gonna let him plunge into oblivion. Jack Abbott is gonna learn, if he hasn't learned already, that no one tampers with the life of Victor Newman. From the young and the restless, Eric Braden. Well, now as a proposition, that sucks. You got a better idea? Oh, that's one thing you never have to worry about. 
You solicit me, you come to my door, you walk in my house, you hire my wife. And I guarantee you a better idea. For life. A friend you will never lose. A singing Mexican at your funeral. From Santa Barbara, A. Martinez. This woman who tells nothing but the truth told you that she had no motive, no reason. The prosecution has not given us a reason. The prosecution has no eyewitness to the crime. The only thing the prosecution has presented is a thin string of circumstantial evidence. I've observed you men and women for several days now. And I honestly don't believe that any one of you can, in clear conscience, find Felicia Gallant guilty beyond a reasonable doubt. From another world, Stephen Schnitzer. Have you ever been out of home? Have you ever been hungry? I mean, really hungry? Because that's never going to happen to me again. I saw it kill my mother. It broke her spirit day by day and killed her when she was still a young woman. They pushed her around all her life. They laughed at Stuart because he was different. They, they took advantage of my sister Lottie. Well, I swore that one day I would protect my family from that kind of abuse and I succeeded, Brooke. I have succeeded and I'm not going to let it go and I'm not going to stop fighting for what I've got and I'm damn sure not going to let Palmer Cortland take everything I own. And from all my children, David Canary. And the winner is from Santa Barbara. Thank you. I want to thank Marcy Walker, my partner. Um, I love you too. It's uh, it's so wonderful to be on Santa Barbara. My, my uh, son saw a movie that I was in about 15 years ago recently, and I was uh, wandering around doing some ridiculous thing. And he, uh, the next day I heard him in the yard screaming, ow, ow, ow. And I, and I said, Cody, are you okay? He said, yes, Daddy, I'm acting. <laughs> and uh, it, it made me think about the fact <laughs> that my career used to be about ow almost all the time until I got to be on Santa Barbara. So thank you, everyone, for this. It's an honor. <laughs> And I'm thrilled to get on it for something that's such a pleasure to do. Thank you. A kiss? Oh, uh, not right now. You, you really don't want to kiss me. Dangerous. Very dangerous. Give me a minute, honey. Don't let morning breath ruin a good morning. Get Scope. Scope has two powerful ingredients to kill 90% of the bacteria that cause morning breath. Didn't I, I hear something about a kiss? Right here. Right now. Kiss. It is time for a kiss. Scope. The best thing, first thing in the morning. Hey, you. Put that kiss right here. Um, how much longer? Soon. Now, CoverGirl okay. brings you lip color that lasts beyond your first cup of coffee. Your see you later kiss. Announcing Lip Advance. Extra long wearing cream powder color. Plus a top coat that's lustrous and moist. Created to stay luscious long after you've nibbled and sipped. I've heard that before. New Lip Advance Lasting Lip Color. Only from CoverGirl. The best undressed bodies of 1990. What are they wearing? The barest essentials. What else are they wearing? 
designer imposters body sprays. They're designer quality fragrances, but not designer prices. They're only around $3 each. So let them fragrance you, refresh you, keep you cool and inviting all over. Designer imposters body sprays, only from Parfums de Coeur. The best undressed bodies in the world wear them. Buff Puff Daily Cleanser invites your skin to a 30-second revival. It's a clean new feeling that'll awaken softer, fresher skin. Because only Daily Cleanser has something special inside. Gentle micro bead capsules filled with precious moisturizer to leave your skin radiantly soft. Buff Puff Daily Cleanser. It feels good. The daily revival for your skin. The world's greatest float maker will now demonstrate how to make an A&W root beer float. First, the ice cream. Next, the rich, creamy A&W root beer. Now his assistant will make an equally delicious A&W cream soda float. The ice cream. The A&W cream soda. An A&W float is a great treat for you, your family, or a flock of friends. Please welcome the hottest and most confused romantic couple in daytime. From One Light to Live, Nicholas Walker and Fiona Hutchison. The programs we honor with the nominations for outstanding daytime drama are consistently enlightening, entertaining, and enticing. Fiona, I always love when you're enticed. These are the four shows that people who work in daytime television have chosen as the best. The nominees are... All My Children, ABC. Guiding Light, CBS. Santa Barbara. The Young and the Restless, CBS. And the winner is... The winner is... Santa Barbara! When the city of Santa Barbara heard that uh, Bridget and Jerry Dobson were going to create another one, they didn't think it was possible. Well, let me introduce you to the people who make it possible. The gifted writers, directors, and actors at tables T, U, and F. <laughs> They'd really like to see you all after the telecast come over, say hello. They'd like to thank you personally. I'd like to introduce my colleagues who produced the show that the Blue Ribbon Panel judged. Ladies and gentlemen, the producing team from Santa Barbara, headed by Jill Farron Phelps. <laughs> Mr. Stephen Kent. Charlotte Savage. Julie Hannah Carole. Jeff Lerner. We have the good fortune to be associated with New World Television. Mr. John Feltheimer, Mr. James McNamara, Mr. Jerry Emmett, and Ms. Sandra Stern. The NBC Television Network, Mr. Brandon Tartikoff, Miss Jackie Smith. Miss Eleanor Timberman, and we all thought we would take our Emmys, meld them into one large one, and give it to Susan Lee for a job very well done. <laughs> Mr. 
we would like to thank the Blue Ribbon Panel, and we would like to thank our audience for watching Santa Barbara. And for those of you who don't watch us yet, please join us. Come see why we win these. <laughs> and I have a crew and a staff back in Los Angeles who have made me believe that anything is possible. We all would like to thank you. We're very proud and we're very happy. I stalk the wild gorilla, careful not to be noticed. He moves in and out of the light. But with 35mm one film from Polaroid, I can capture this majestic creature in low light, bright light, inside or out. With the same roll of one film, I can shoot under almost any conditions. 35mm one film, the simple choice from Polaroid. Ah, oh, the thrill of safari. Next stop is the polar bear. Wait! just what we do, it's who we are. Someone to watch over me. When you have as little as 12 months to grow from a newborn into an adult, every day is crucial. A growing puppy needs about twice the nutrition of an adult dog. That's why we put extra protein and iron in Purina Puppy Chow brand puppy food. Because without extra nutrition now, your puppy could face a tough climb ahead. For years I've been telling my customers, whether it's original or lemon lime, that palm olive dishwashing liquid softens hands while you do dishes. If it didn't, I'd have been washed up long ago. Uh -huh. <gasps> a wart makes it difficult to express yourself with your hands. Clear away wart remover removes warts faster than compound W liquid. Our medicated disc dissolves the wart while the cover-up disc conceals it. Clear away from Dr. Scholl's. Conceals as it heals. Hi, I'm Rick Dees, and welcome to End of the Night. Oh, miss. <laughs> Into the Night, starring Rick Dees. He's trying to change the way you look at late-night TV. The 17th Annual Daytime Emmy Awards, brought to you by 35mm One Film, the simple choice from Polaroid. Colgate Products, because your smile was meant to last a lifetime. Tylenol, caring isn't just what we do, it's who we are. And... Ralston Purina Company, Checkerboard Square. We thank you for watching. We'll see you next year. Bye. Hi, everyone.